First off, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with me. I know you're a super busy guy, like, I don't know, writing music and playing Fortnite and eating burgers. I, I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day. I'd like to say that I know this is your first interview and you are doing a really, really amazing job, man. And I'm really excited to speak with you. If I can be honest, I was a little nervous for this interview, but I can already tell that you are baller as hell. Thank you so much. 100%. Um, what's your first question? We are here to talk about your first album. What can fans expect to hear throughout? It's pretty much like a space odyssey mixed with a little this, little that, some beats, some melodies. It's pretty epic. You could even say it's amazeballs. I'm sorry. Did you say amazeballs? I love that word, and I'm gonna steal it. Next question. Okay, let's talk release date. From what you just described, the album sounds pretty fucking intellectual, so when can your fans expect to have their brains uploaded to a higher consciousness of thinking after slamming your riffs in their big ol' ear holes? Uh, it is pretty fucking intellectual, but I'd also say that the album is pretty... Oh, it's called Block It Out, by the way. It's pretty, like, quantum, like, stargazy, and shit. What was the release date on that again? Think of it like this. December 18th is the day that your eardrums are born. Uh, just imagine, like, hearing sound for the first time. Uh, actually, imagine the feeling of waking up and your boss calls you and says, you don't have to go into work today. Just stay at home as long as you want and play Fortnite. And here's a million dollars. And you're gonna do great things in the future. And I am so proud of you. That's what it's like. That is really deep. Um, but just in case uh, viewers didn't catch that, the release date is December 18th. Um, but for real, you are, you are killing it lately. Um, but I do have a two part question. Um, so first part, I saw that you posted something online about a pre-order. Um, are you telling me that you have this amazing album on wax? Second part, uh, and, but I didn't dream to think this and I don't really even want to bring it up, but a lot of people have an issue with how long it took to put out. Um, they were a little TO'd that you posted coming soon updates for three years. So I guess my question is, what do you have to say to these, frankly, monstrous people? It's available for pre-order. Check this out. I am so happy for you that I'm not even gonna press you on the second half of that question. Um, so where can people pre-order that bad boy? They can head to seasalt.bandcamp.com to grab a pre-order, or they can be lamos and wait till it comes out on the 18th, but honestly, who wants to do that? Honestly, I can't think of anything more disgusting than someone waiting for it to come out to buy it. Don't they know that this thing is gonna change their lives? You are a really, really smart guy, and I really like you. Um, I want you to do all of my interviews. I only want to interview you. Man, these lights are pretty hot. Don't you think? I don't think the lights are the problem. Come here and give me a kiss. I think we've got what we needed here. Um, to recap, December 18th, your album comes out, pre-orders on Bandcamp, and they ship the week of the 7th. I guess that's it. Thank you so much for your time, and I will see you forever.